Hey, good morning, y'all. It is cold, breezy, and cloudy. Miserable. But it's perfect conditions to catch some catfish. Y'all stick around and fish with me for a little while. All right, y'all. I've got a couple baits out. This rig I'm using, it's just a little three-way. It's real easy to tie. If you, I did a, a double hook rig video a while back. If you look at it, it'll show you how to tie it. You're just tying a couple loop knots. And you put your hook on. It'll come off. You can change it out real easy. Same way with the weight. But, uh, what, well, the reason I'm using it, it's nothing, no specific reason. I just kept getting hung up at the last place I was fishing and breaking off my usual Carolina rig. And, and uh, it's got a 50 pound leader on it. And, but, uh, all I was catching was little fish and I kept breaking off. So this was quick and easy to tie and I put smaller hooks on. Now, that's why I'm using it. Nothing wrong with it. It's a great rig. I know a guy who's caught fish over 60 pounds using this rig. Tied with this 30 pound test line that I'm using. I'm using uh, uh, the Berkeley Big Game. And um, it's good stuff. But yeah, that's the rig we're using. Real easy rig, good rig. But uh, all right, I'm gonna finish baking this up and uh, or baking these up and see y'all when we catch fish. Slacked my line. Been a lot of that going on this morning. Well, he might be on there. He might be running in with it. I think that might be the case. Yeah. Yeah, we got him. Yeah, we got the little feller. Where are you, little fella? There he is. <laughs> He's sandwich size. Oh, I'm just gonna pick him up here. I say I am, yep. Here he comes. Oh, I got one on this other pole. Shoot for. He slacked this line. Oh, I guess that's all he's gonna do. Alright, let's take care of this one. Oh, ooh. Alright, there he is. He's dirty, but he'll still eat good. I got some friends wanting to have a fish fry. And uh, they know I'm fishing all the time, so I got the call to catch the fish and cook it, but <laughs> that's all right with me. Okay, we're gonna put him in the bucket, y'all. Oh, I'm about to lose a pole. Ah, uh, is he still on there? Yep, he's still on there. <laughs> I was back there trying to take care of that other fish I just caught. And this one went down. He's a little bigger. Still an eater though. He ain't much bigger. He might have just been a little meaner. Well, this is a tricky looking little trail, ain't it? I ain't walking down it unless I have to. <laughs> Come on up here, buddy. Oh, a tangled mess. <laughs> there he is y'all all right i'm gonna get these fish took care of and get bait back in the water you on there you sure ah he ain't yep oh that other rod over there's going oh we got this one 
Yeah, that other rod over there was getting a bite. It wasn't going nowhere. <laughs> been a lot of bites this morning. That's, that's how it's been lately. Let's get this little fella up here. There he comes. Oh, wouldn't you know, my weight's hung up. Oh, come loose. Where you at? Woohoo! <laughs> oh, shoot. Well, come here. All right, we got him. He's just, I kept some about this size the other day. It's just almost too little, but. I'm going to keep him anyway. All right. In the bucket he'll go. All right. Here real quick. I'm going to tie up this rig. Show you all how I tie it up. I'm one of the easiest rigs you can uh, tie. But all right. We're going to double up our line here. Just doing a simple overhand knot. Want that loop to be big enough for your weight to fit through it. You got a little extra there. You can cut that off if you want. If you don't, it's fine too. Here, let me go ahead and cut it off because it'll bother me. <laughs> oh, shoot. Here's it. Here's our weight. All right. Now you just want to pinch the end of your loop down. Put it through the eye of your weight like that, then run your weight through the loop. And you can change weights or whatever you need to do that way. Well, look at that mess. All right, there we go. Just like so. Now go about a foot or two, whatever you wanna do, foot and a half. Take your line, do it just like so. Okay, then with your fingers here, you want to just twist this about five or six times. And then pull this one back through. And you really just grab that with your teeth is the easiest way. But I'm trying to make sure y'all can see what's going on. Okay, and yeah, just pull everything tight. Hope y'all could see that, tell what I was doing. But that's it, you put your hook on. The same way you do your weight. I always go through the front of my hook eye. Some knots require it, some don't. I just go through it all the time to be on the safe side. Some of the knots I use are required anyway. There you go. That's it. Real easy. That's it. Good strong rig. A lot of people use it. I, I like the one I use. It's just about what you're comfortable with. But that's a good rig there, y'all. I had to do a bait check on that other rod and putting it out. This one about got pulled in. <laughs> I like it when they bite like that. I just changed, well, I did a bait check on it. This one didn't have no bait on it. I just put it out there. There he comes. Oh, he's in my other line now. Shoot. I just threw it out, so it's just laying out there loose. Now I'm going to have a tangled up mess. Let me see if I can figure this out, y'all. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, y'all. <laughs> I had a tangled mess. And it really took me way too long to untangle it. <laughs> but here he is. White hook got in there good. But all right, we'll put him in the bucket. All right, y'all, well, it's Saturday and a lot of people are out fishing. My spot I was at earlier got a little crowded, so uh, I backed on out of there and we're gonna give this spot a try. rod got hit and that rod's getting hit what am i going to do <laughs> oh shoot this line over here slack but this one's still messing with it i'll just let him mess with it and i'll tighten this line up oh it wasn't that bad all right what are you going to do here cowboy Ooh wee He's still jacking with it. Little dude, get serious. He might, oh, he might be hooked. That happens a lot lately. The little ones, they get on there fooling with it and just get hooked. Let's see. Yeah, he's on there. Yeah, we got him. Uh-oh, that rod over there just bounced. up in the grass out there Ooh. all right there he is <laughs> snagged him on the lip all right there he is y'all in the bucket. He keeps running in and I keep thinking I'm losing. <laughs> No bigger than he is, I probably wouldn't know if I had him or lost him either way. <laughs> He's a little fella. There he is. Lot of grass out there. Uh oh, look here, y'all. Oh, he slapped it. <laughs> Dang, I just dropped him. He's just hanging out now. Oh, shoot. Oh, well. I guess if he's hungry enough, he'll come back. Let's take care of this guy. <laughs> There he is. Another one for the bucket. Well, he put a little pull on it. Well, I guess that's all he's gonna do. 
little fella. Oh, there goes that one. Let's see if it's going to do something. I don't know why we just can't get some pole benders. He's slacking my line. Still slacking it. He may have it in his mouth. Yeah, he does. Oh, I was reeling down on him and I lost my, lost my handle. But we got him. Well, I think we do. I meant in all that grass out there. Yeah, we got him. <laughs> oh, there he is. Still got one up there messing with that other rod. <laughs> Here he is, y'all. I'm gonna put him in the bucket. Pretty little blue. You no, know, he might be hooked, y'all. Yep, yeah, he is. Yep. It felt pretty pretty heavy when I first realized he was hooked. Might have been wrapped around something. That's probably why he wasn't pulling my rod any harder than he was. We got him, and I think we got, we got some, uh, probably enough fish, I'm sure, for that fish fry our friends are wanting to have. It's going to be good. I'm excited about it. That's, that's how we do our gatherings, usually. It's just fish fry. Everybody comes over, and we fry up the fish. He is a tangled mess. Don't get me hooked. You rascal. All right, y'all. There it is. That's probably going to be the last one. Whoop. If he don't get away. <laughs> All right. Here he is, y'all. We're going to put him in the bucket. All right, y'all. Well, I got me a mess of fish to go home and clean. I'm going to get out of here. But, uh. Hope y'all enjoy this video. If so, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more like it, hit subscribe.